things that I can't live without. Muslin, my inspiration mood book, and my pencil. In designing a dress, I start with a collection that comes from an inspiration for the season. So I usually create an inspiration mood board. Uh, it can be anything from really abstract elements to textures, to photographs, to words, anything that really kind of gets me going. And then I start looking at fabrics and sometimes a fabric will inspire a dress and sometimes a dress will inspire a fabric. So it can work both ways for me. And so I start sketching the collection based off of that and then work with my pattern maker and give her all the specs and measurements. She then creates a paper pattern and then our cutter cuts muslin from a paper pattern. We usually cut it in muslin first because you don't want to cut it in the real fabric. And then it gets sewn up and then it goes through its first fitting on our fit model. And then we do adjustments and it goes through the whole process again. And that is how you do my job.